instead of fighting. Like Dr. Rodriguez said, we will never understand the nature of the Godhead. But just let's state by faith what the Bible says and let us submit ourselves to the power of the Holy Spirit and He will do great things through you. And the last chapter of the book of Acts, the book of the Holy Spirit, will contain miracles that happen in Guyana because you have submitted yourself to the power of the Holy Spirit. George, over the weekend, uh, members of the Seventh day Adventist Church hosted what was termed the International Bible Conference, where several speakers from across the world came and presented on different topics. Um, several of them had very special insights into the field of evangelism, and they brought their expertise from around the world. Many of them shared personal experiences on how God has led, how the Holy Spirit has worked. Some of them spoke of the development that is happening within Christianity, and particularly at Adventism around the world, and here are some excerpts from what was said over the weekend. Tell us a little about what your focus was for this seminar here this, this weekend. Well, uh, this weekend we have chosen uh, the topic of the Godhead, the issue of uh, Trinity, and also um, we will have uh, some issues of interpretation that will be presented. Then some difficult pa passages like Daniel 11 will be presented. Then uh, how to understand the statement living without the intercessor will be... Our purpose here is to study the Bible with our members here. And I have two basic topics. One is about the Godhead, the person of God, the Trinity, which is a very important teaching of the Bible. And the other topic that I will address this afternoon is about hermeneutics. What are the rules, what are the principles that we should use in order to understand the Bible better? You have the work of the Spirit and you have nature. the nature of the Spirit, the two. And we put great emphasis on the work, the nature, the work of the Spirit, sanctification, the gift of prophecy, and so on and so on. Um, what is the conference? In, what is the conference intention of this program? Well, I want to suggest that as a conference, we have been very cons well. Uh, it, we 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 intentional about building the theological and doctrinal. Uh, perspectives and concepts of our leaders across this conference and we thought that this would have been a good opportunity to bring some of the leading theological minds of our church at the Biblical Research Institute to who have, have studied and reflected deeply theologically on some important matters particularly it has to do with issues of the Trinity the Godhead the, the, the roles of you know the Father the Son the Holy Spirit etc um, some distinctives for example is the sanctuary we thought that uh, we wanted to help our members to develop a greater understanding of these of these concepts. George, some of the issues range from creation to righteousness by faith. Some very hot button topics were discussed. Also being discussed was work, the work that was going on in uh, once Soviet Union, uh, Russia, the Soviet Union, the work that has been done there with the breaking down of walls, um, where established religion was able to come into some of those countries. Thanks for watching Headline News. Leave a like or a comment below. And for updates on the latest news happening in Guyana, click the subscribe button.